Hi guys, welcome to ASA Technical. In this video, I'm going to show you how to safely remove an operating system from dual boot configuration with Windows 10, Windows 11 and Linux. Deleting an operating system partition from a dual boot setup, it is not as simple as deleting a primary partition. It is recommended that you follow the steps carefully and ensure that you have backups of all important data before proceeding. Because, number one, deleting an operating system can result in the loss of data stored on the partition associated with that operating system. Number two, if the bootloader is not configured correctly after deleting an operating system, your computer may fail to boot or displaying an error message. Number three, if you have files stored on the partition associated with the deleted operating system, you may no longer be able to access those files without specialized software or tools. And number 4. Improperly deleting an operating system may damage system files and render the remaining operating system unusable. However, now let's take a closer look how you can securely delete an operating system from a dual configuration from a dual boot setup. First, you need to determine which operating system you want to delete. So, you first need to boot into the operating system that you want to keep. Here, I will be demonstrate by deleting Windows 11, so here I will be boot into Windows 10. After that, go to search box and type system configuration. In the System Configuration Utility, go to Boot tab. Next, you will see a list of all the operating system installed on your computer. Now, select that operating system which you want to keep and set as default button. If it's already set as default, then fine. Next, select the operating system you want to delete and click the delete button. This will remove the operating system from the list of available operating systems. Set the minimum timeout as 3 seconds. Now click apply and click ok to close system configuration window. Now system configuration will ask for the restart. Now simply click the restart button and it will directly boot into the remaining operating system. That's it. Well, as you can see, our Windows 11 was deleted successfully from dual boot setup. Here, I'll be demonstrate by deleting Windows 10 or Linux. So here, I'll be boot into Windows 11. Also, you can use a Windows bootable USB drive to perform this operation. If you don't have a Windows bootable USB drive, then here's a certain tutorial for you. Now, insert your Windows installation media and go to your PC's BIOS or PC's boot manager to boot from there.
ओपन एन एलिवेटेड कॉमन प्रॉम्प्ट बाय प्रेसिंग द शिफ्ट की प्लस एफ टेन की कॉम्बिनेशन इन द कॉमन प्रॉम्प्ट टाइप बी सी डी एडिट स्पेस फॉरवर्ड स्लैश ई एन यू एम एंड प्रेस एंटर दिस विल डिस्प्ले अ लिस्ट ऑफ ऑल द बूट एंट्रीज ऑन योर सिस्टम Locate the entry for the operating system you want to remove and copy its identifier. A long alphanumeric string in curly braces. To remove the entry, type bcd edit space forward slash delete space and paste here the identifier alphanumeric string that you have copied and press enter. Now type exit and press enter. Restart your computer to confirm that the deleted operating system is no longer listed in the boot menu. That's it. You have successfully deleted an operating system from dual boot computer. Now you can delete the deleted operating system partition from Windows Disk Management. And please don't forget to take a backup any important files before proceeding. I hope this tutorial is helpful for you. Please like, comment and share. We need your support and don't forget to subscribe our channel as the technical. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.